kill him. Don't say that. I would. I'd kill him. It says he was rushed to hospital in a critical condition. Felix. Irene, if you've opened this, I'll never forgive you or hate you forever. Trace, you are not going anywhere no, until we have finished talking and... No, get... I hate you! I hate you! If, and big if, you get to stay here, it will be because it's the best thing for you, not because you can afford to pay. I'll ring Irene, and if it's okay with her, well, then we'll try and find somewhere to put you, but it's only temporary. Right, everyone does. Hey, it's my favourite show, I think. Oh, Dimash. Give that back. I don't know, mate. It is kind of boring. <laughs> Give it back. Tell me about it. Guys! Is this a night in the zoo? As long as we don't have enough kids here already. I know, but it's just for a few nights, just to give Irene some breathing space. Yeah, it just would have been nice to have been included in the decision, that's all. I'm sorry, love. It, it was just one of those things. I mean, I was here and you were at work. What? There's no more juice? So have a glass of water, I won't kill you. But Tasha wants juice. So? So she's our guest. We have to look after her. Well, Tasha certainly seems to be making herself at home. Didn't I just have a juice? What did you do that for? You were needed. No, I was thinking about what you said before the operation. Everything's going to work out for us now. I always knew that you were going to be okay, but pretty freaked. Yeah, me too. But I think you're right. I've got the same feeling. Our future's going to be great from now on. Yeah. And you put all the bad stuff behind us. Yes. And do all the things we've been talking about, all the stuff that we want to do. Like, except for the recommitment ceremony. Why? Oh, what's this with Haley and Noah's wedding coming up? I, I think we should wait. I still want to do it, though. Go on. Uh, um... No, don't. Let's go. Don't what? Tell me. You know, our holiday that we're planning? Mm -hmm. I don't think it's going to happen. It's just, Tash is throwing her money around like a crazy person. Mm. And I just think we should give back what she gets. She's on this trip where she's trying to buy people, so... Yeah, right. I'm sorry, babe, but we should just set an example. Yeah, no, no, no. I understand. I wonder where you got to. Any place to get a bit of peace and quiet. Why does she get everything she wants? Just I was kill her. It. It's not fair. I wanted to watch the other channel. I'll stop just with your baby. When I agreed to let Tasha stay, I wasn't planning on World War III breaking out. I'm sorry I didn't talk to you. Just having one of those days, I guess. Is there anything that I can do to help? You're doing it already. Uh, Mrs. Roberts is here, and uh, Tash said she didn't want to talk to her. Great. Just what we need. More drama. Only she saw me, she bolted upstairs. Closely followed by Robbie. Uh, look, I, I brought around some, some clothes and stuff. Um, but there's uh, something that I have to give her in person. It's, it's very important. Tasha, could you come down here, please? I've got a few things to sort out, but I'm hoping that she'll see sense and come back home with me. That'd be best, yeah. Well, Muhammad won't come to the mountain. No, right? hang on, Irene. She can come down here. I'm really sorry, love. This is putting you out, isn't it? No, it's not. Truly, it's no trouble. And it's important that you two get to chat. Thanks, so. Maddie, could you come and give me a hand with the dishes, please? Max, could you go upstairs and fetch Tasha, please? Matilda's like her slave. She can do it. 
Crikey, Charlie, it is not that big a request, mate. I'm not asking you to fly to the moon. Where is she? Sorry, but Tash doesn't want to see you. I don't think there's any point in hanging around. She said she won't come down while you're here. Oh, really? Yeah. Tasha! You'll come down here now! And I mean now! Darling, come down. No, Beth, this has gone far enough. Tash up! We're waiting. talk about oh, all right what if i told you that i've got something of yours the letter it's from duncan you shouldn't have opened that you have no right i to never do opened that. the flipping thing how do thing? you know who it's from because his name is on the back give it to me not until i've said my piece you shouldn't have gone into my room i told you to leave and me i alone. told you the only reason i went in there was to find that money for your own good you know what, Tash, you can keep your little secrets from me. I respect that. What I don't respect is you throwing that money around. It's none of your business what I do with it. Oh, really? Well, I've got news for you, girlie. I have to care about you, so that makes it my business. All right, I interfered. But you know what? I'd do it again in a minute, so you're not going to get any apology from me on that count. Tash, love, I'm giving you this as an act of faith to prove that you can trust me. Trust you. All you're doing is giving me back what's mine. Tash! Love, please, we can sort this out. There's nothing to sort out. The sun will want me here. This is where I'm staying. Yeah, well, I think we should get something straight right away, young lady. We didn't invite you here, Tash. From what I understand, you invited yourself. You're upset, you, you needed a break. That's why Irene and Beth agreed you could stay here. And it's fine. You're a nice girl. I like you. We all like you. You just want to get rid of me. That's not true. No, I thought you were on my side. I was trying to give you a holiday, like, make you happy. Let's discuss this, Tash. You lied to me. You said Boy, that's safe. enough. Uh, <laughs> no, Tash, you just calm down. Can you let go of me? Uh, look, not so long ago, you actually said you'd be proud if I was your dad. Well, you know what? I'd be really ashamed to be your father the way you're carrying on. Tash. Tash, what's going on? Here we go again. Tash! Did you have to go in quite so hard? Beth, if someone had put their foot down with that young girl a long time ago, she wouldn't be in the trouble she's in now. Yes, she sounds like a lot. Huh. How is she, Dad? Yeah, she's um, pretty exhausted, but she's happy to be home. Yeah, but she's... I, uh, I don't suppose Tasha has turned up, has she? No, I thought she was staying at the Sutherland. I'll get it. Here? Hi, I'm Detective Baker, Yabby Creek Police. Oh, God. What's happened? Where is she? I'm sorry? Tasha, what's she done? I don't know anything about anyone called Tasha. Why should I? No, no, sorry. Um, what can I do for you? I'd like to talk to Kane Phillips if he's around. This is about Felix Waters, yeah? Can I just wait till tomorrow? My wife just got out of hospital. I'm just wondering what makes you think I'm here about Felix Walters. Oh, come off it. I know you're going to be checking out anyone who's had any contact with him in the last couple of weeks. So you've dealt with the police before, have you? You're lucky I haven't checked my record. <laughs> okay, so there are a few questions I'd like answered. So it's either here or at the station. It's your call. I will answer any questions. I will even come down the cop shop. Just wait till tomorrow, please. Um, Detective, give the kids a break. They've had a real rough trot lately. Kirsty's only just lost a baby. Yeah, uh, thanks, Irene, but it doesn't need to know my life story. Look, I promise you, Kane will be at the police station tomorrow. Any time you like, you have my personal guarantee. How can I resist a promise like that? OK, I'll leave it for tonight. But I'll pick you up in the morning and run you over to Abbey Creek. Mm, Show for service. Honoured. Oh, we'd hate you to lose your way. I'll, uh, I'll show you out. You're, you're new, aren't you? Are you replacing um, Inspector Carter? Yeah. Oh, this girl, Tasha, if you're worried about her, I could... No, no, look, Julie, it's, 
It's fine. She she spat the dummy. She took off. I'm I'm sure she'll be back as soon as she calms down. Teenagers, I think. Mr. Phillips, I'll see you in the morning, 8:30 on the dock. Yep. I'll be here. Bye, Mr. Roberts.